Good day, everybody. Well, I'm being a bit lazy this week, unfortunately. I freaking don't know what happened to the weekend, but it's kind of been warm this weekend, and I never really felt like doing it. So I'm going to make it a real quick one today. Um, and just basically, Aprocon's coming up in two weeks. Two weeks! Two weeks, one fortnight away, and we'll be down in the city streets of Pennsylvania, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, acting a fool. Y'all gotta act a fool. But, I will be at that convention, I will have my suit, and I will be doing suiting and doing all this other stuff, and we'll be ha having a good time out there down in Pennsylvania, so I'll see you there next week. But also, I would like to make an announcement that the schedule, the schedule for panels has come out, and I will be participating in one of those panels, um, for a nonfiction and journalism, um, at 9 p.m. on Saturday. So at 9 p.m. on Saturday, if there's nothing else of interest and you want to bore yourself to tears about people talking about real life world stuffs about furry nonfiction and stuffs, you could come there and be bored. No, I'm just kidding. We'll try and liven it up a little bit. But mostly it is a writing panel. It will be talking mostly about the writing aspect of things and stuff like that. Most writing panels, you know, people are interested in writing panels and stuff like that. Not a lot of nonfiction furry um, writing panels. They've been kind of coming about lately, similar with um, basically this year is the first year that Ursa Majors has uh, introduced the, a nonfiction award um, for writing um, in, for writing about fandom events, which is very cool. And I hope that continue, the, the trend continues. I just happen to be in the right place at the right time with things trending and stuff like that. And it happens sometimes. But learning how to do it and stuff like that. So I basically got to spend the next few weeks figuring out what I'm going to talk about. Wait a minute. What am I, what am I going to talk about? I better figure that out in two weeks. You only got two weeks, man. Panic. Panic. Make all the panic. Now I'll talk with, I'll talk with my co-panelist, Cross Affliction, about what we will uh, discuss that over the next few weeks. Um, I'm sure we'll have something presentable. It won't be one of those awkward panels where people are like, um, what the heck is going on here? I don't know what's going on here. One of the, one of the most awkward panels we went to was um, that I've ever experienced was one of those panels. I don't know if you've ever been to one of these. But it was like some pokey fur meet and greet, like some from a long time ago. And all they did was basically go around the room. Like there was like, there was hundreds and there was like hundreds of people there. And they basically did this sort of like everyone line up and talk about yourself for like, and then it's kind of like, I mean, that's, that's fine and all, but it's like, I don't think like literally for people who are shy and don't want to talk about themselves, that's a no-go. And for people who want to talk about themselves, like, you're going to have to wait a long time before you get to talk about yourself. So, you know, coming up with a plan on what you discuss. Luckily for, for our particular panel, it's about, you know, us having an expertise in something and, and, and sharing that expertise um, with individuals. Also sharing good resources on where you can find out if you want to self-learn and all that stuff. So that's a good thing. But anyways, as I said, 9 o'clock, Saturday night, um, probably in the whatever the writing section is for Anthrocon. I don't know, I've been, been there in a few years. So um, you could go to the description below, and there's the schedule for 2017 for Anthrocon, if you haven't seen it yet. Um, but I will see you there, and I hope you all have a happy Father's Day, all you... All you baby daddies out there and all you daddy daddies, good on you. Raise those kids right. Raise those kids right, man. It's up to you. We're counting on you, all right? Keep doing, good, keep doing a good job. 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 All right? I'm going to get the hop out of here. Kick a like, kick a subscribe. I don't know why you do it on this video because I'm being lazy. It's too hot, man. It's too hot. It's too hot. It's too hot. It's June. It's June, man. It's hot. Oh, before I go though, um, next week it is Pride Month, and I don't. I haven't forgotten you, dudes. I haven't. I haven't forgotten. 
I haven't forgotten you rainbow dudes. Where is it? I haven't forgotten you, you rainbow dudes. You rainbow warriors out there. I've got a video. I have one more video before Anthrocon. Because I'm not going to have a video two weeks from now. Because Anthrocon's going to be going on and I'm not going to have time to record a video and put it up here. Alright? But, there's one more week in the month of June that I get to talk about something. Um, about this. About Pride Month. <clears throat> it'll, uh, it'll be interesting. I think it's going to be... I might not fursuit for it, because I think it's a very important topic, I think it's something that needs to be discussed, and it's a discovery I made back in college days that is a very big discovery, and I think that it's very important that this discovery be shared with a lot of other people, um, it particularly has to do with um, Christianity, religion, and its ties with um, the anti-gay sort of lines in it, and a discovery I made regarding those lines. Um, particularly about its translation. Um, it'll be a big one, and you know, I don't think you're going to want to miss it, so you're going to want to watch this this channel next week, and I will discuss that. Um, probably not in suit, as I said. I'll probably need to, I'll need to make a lot of references to written works and links and stuff like that, so probably those will be the visual cues and stuff like that. And plus, it gives me an excuse because things get too hot, I, then I can just, you know, do a video sort of out of suit. Um, but I will see you on that video, and I'll see you at Anthrocon if I don't see you before then. Thank you very much for watching. As always, I'm going to get the hop out of here. Have a good one.